Uh, Team November, come in. Yeah, I got Ms. Wong, the manager at the Sands Lux Apartments on the line. Shush, 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 let me talk to them. You're leaving out important details. Uh... It's the weirdo in apartment three. He's gonna kill us all. There's all kinds of loud banging coming from his room. And he's not alone. He's got friends in there. They're planning something, I know it. Do you think I would have called you if the marshals had listened to me? They say I call too much. Goddamn lazy good for nothings. Maybe there was nothing going on those other times, but this one's real. I'm sure of it. Come to the Sands Lux Apartments, now! That loony's liable to blow the whole place sky high! Uh, sorry, November. Over and out. Huh? What do you mean by sorry? You read the last issue of the Colorado Patriot? Oh, real funny cartoon in there. When Jeffy ripped the robo arm off that scar collector and cracked up. I was gonna ask about the articles. Extra, extra, bloody shootout in Garden of the Gods! You, Troy! Those old... It's okay, Brandy. I got this. Get lost, you perv douche... But... Wait a minute. You're old, right? Can you get us some beers? Those stupid Mary Milk Teeth won't sell us any. Too young, she says. Uh, ew. Light? Guess it's got alcohol, so whatever. Thanks. Oh, yay! <laughs> Maybe I'll join the Christmas. I do like the I'm sure they can use my help. Maybe go. Jimmy Bob, huh? Let's. this job. Uh, who? Junko Murayama, sculptor, roboticist, amateur historian, and former curator of the Colorado Springs Museum of History. Can you believe it? I really fixed up that museum. Before me, just a bunch of dirty old trash we had to go look at five times a year in school. I brought the place into the 22nd century, scavenged some old robot parts to rebuild the animatronics, remade all the replicas from scratch, cleaned all the blood off the scar collector weapons. Good stuff. Officially, because of the Dorsey raid. But I think they didn't like the questions I was asking about the Patriarch's history while I was renovating the exhibits. 
I mean, why else would they tell me they'll be hiring a new curator? What's that got to do with the raid? I don't even know. I sent Diligent Joe, the Patriarch's private secretary, a list of questions about the Dorsey family and the routing of the Plains gangs. Just trying to clear up a few weird discrepancies, you know? Well, he doesn't get back to me, and then the raid happens, and I'm out on my ass with no explanation. That's weird, right? Heck yeah, I am! It was a real sight to behold before they shut it down. Animatronic exhibits portraying our great history, true relics of our struggle to survive, displayed for all to see. Just some real A-plus quality work, if I do say so myself. That's rad! Heck yes! Thank you! You won't regret this. I'll see you back at your HQ. Hey, Jones! Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium, Sardine Lee. It was an old security drone. Its timing belt broke, so it uh, vibrates real fast. Jones, welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium, my store Sardine Lee.
strangers. This is Daisy. Sounds like you're at the Little Vegas, judging by all that noise in the background. Remember, your first order of business is to find Delgado. Maybe somebody in there has seen him. While you're at it, if you can prove that Brago made a deal with the Dorseys, feel free to take that bastard down. Best of We've got drinks, dancing, and games of chance. Pick your poison. We've got drinks, dancing, and games of chance. Pick your poison. What's your Fuck me! Song? Gotta be sex dwarf. It bops so hard. Oh, welcome to Little Vegas, friends. Care to play some blackjack? A small fee gets you a seat at the table and wins pay even money. Well played, friends. Another hand? Just put down a small bet. Well played, friends. Another hand? As you wish. This table's always hot. Come back anytime. Fuck me! Fuck me! Stairs to get my sh shit out of the safe, but B B Boulder and his mercs took my pants and kicked me out before I could get it. No fucking way I'm dealing with that asshole again. But I need that stash or I'm dead. Can you help me? I owe a lot of money. I don't sell this shit and they'll kill me. In a safe? Up, 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 up. Just watch out for b b Boulder. No more gambling for me. See, you know that. I wish I could have a string like you. Dragged in. I'm stuck with Boar's life. Ah, it's you, Red Hats. I was wondering when you'd come to see Charlie Nose. Farron Brago's capo. Leader of men, hero of the Battle of Two Buttes, savior of St. Elmo, and friend to everyone worth knowing. Welcome to Little Vegas. Sure thing, Red Hats. What can Charlie do for you? El Gato? What? Come on, Charlie, you remember Delgado. Nice guy, family man. Way too good for the trash in this place. No way you could miss him. Oh, not like you, Marshall. You blend right in with the rest of us. Sorry, <laughs> haven't seen him. Old Charlie would tell you if he had. You see this silver ram medal? You like it? It's my favorite badge. The patriarch himself gave it to me. Yes, sir, for saving his elder. I'm the floor boss. I make sure our guests are happy and entertained, and that they don't wander into the back rooms. I can. Jokes aside, Mr. Brago doesn't let anyone into the back without his explicit say-so. And we take Mr. Brago's instructions very seriously. If you want to go back there, talk to him, not me. Why wouldn't I? Isn't that who you are, with your hat so red? Oh well, can't help you if you're confused. Till next time, Red Hats.
six, eight! One, six, eight! One, six, eight! One, six, eight! What are you rents doing in here? This is a private party. Yeah? Well, you picked the wrong room. Ain't no Delgado here. Ha! You mean sh 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 shakes You rents are running errands for a junkie? Get out of here. We're gonna... No, no. You ain't getting off that easy. What we do like... So let's go, runts. It's time to dance. Yes! Good! Good! Time for talking's over! together.
Yeah! Local 168! What are you rents doing in here? This is a private party. Yeah? Well, you picked the wrong room. Ain't no Delgado here, and no m defending Colorado Springs and beating those toothless shit kicker do- Local 168! Let me hear you! Ha! You mean sh 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 shakes You rents are running errands for a junkie? Get out of here. Ha ha ho! So you've got some cojones. Well, if it's a fight you want, the local 168 are happy to oblige. Too late for that ass threat. Get him, crew! Nobody fucks with the 168 and lives. Taking my skins over here. Are you crazy? One, six, eight! One, six, eight! Go hoo hoo! Local 168, booyah! Go hoo hoo! Go hoo hoo! Hell yeah! Local 16. What are you rents doing in here? This is a private party. Ha! You mean sh 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 shakes? You rents are running. Ha ha ho! So you've got some co- Yes! Good! Good! They've spotted us!
Occupants of Colorado Springs are under our protection.
Thank you kindly. That'll do nicely. Yeah, any luck? Do you have my five rhino and five focus? What? Well then, well, that wasn't... You never said anything about my money. It's just a little to even me out. <laughs> That's all. What the hell is going on up there? I can't go two minutes without some mooks beating on each other. God damn it! Now I have to clean up another mess? We need to stop hosting parties up there. Oh man, I love dancing in this place. It's the best. But I've heard a rumor that there's party at the Aspen every year. I'm for sure he'll get it right this year.
Would you rep? You're a barrel of monkeys, huh? Come on, answer the question. All right, all right. Perfect. You're gone faster. Here to serve. <coughs> Pretty sure the marshals are going to make the Reed kid have an accident in his cell. Since he helped the Dorseys get into the city, that's what do you need, Rangers? That's what you pay me for. Have a seat. I won't. I never do. Here to serve. The last issue of the Colorado Patriot? Hostages murdered by Dorsey Thugs! Oh, Weston family dead! Maybe I'll join the Marshals. You like the Buffalo people. I'm sure they could use my name. Hey, it chums! Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium! My store has Sardine Lee! It was an old security drone. Its timing belt broke, so it uh vibrates real fast. I've heard a rumor that there's an exclusive secret dance party. These stairs lead to Mr. Brago's lounge. He said I should let you guys... But don't even think about messing with that computer behind me. I got one job, and that's guarding that computer. And if you was... That is the computer that controls the ventilation system. And I have to guard it because it's broken, and there could be real trouble if anybody said it wrong. Big trouble. If you set the fan to off and the heat to max, which isn't supposed to be... Well... Maybe if a fight broke out, I would, but nobody would be stupid enough. Uh, you're not gonna say I said any of this, are you? What if I need a drink with all that coin you're throwing around? Oh, honey, of course. What do you want? Ugh, Rum so gaudy. Cola? So adorable. Ostentatious. Great choice for nostalgia factor. I. Ranger. Welcome to my club. Uh, 
Ah, Rangers, what a pleasure. I heard you were in town. It must be, what, 20 years since we crossed paths. Oh, not that any of you would remember that, of course. You were probably just kids when Vargas and Angela dead and the rest helped me save Vegas. And I hear we have you to thank for Cassidy's fine Clodius being back in business. My capos and I thank you. If not for Cassidy's, we'd have to settle for second-rate suits from the bazaar. <laughs> but I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm Farron Brigo. Welcome to Little Vegas. My recreation of the glories of that town we lost. Perfect, isn't it? You haven't heard the story? Hey. <laughs> I'll never forget it. Twenty years ago, Vegas was being overrun by robots. A nightmare. Then Angie and Snake and their squad showed up guns a blazing and saved the day. Heroes, every one of them. Helped me consolidate control of the city, too. Of course, 15 years later, the robots came back and destroyed everything. But you know all about that. They attacked you, too. Anyway, that shared history makes me happy you're here. I hope you'll enjoy your stay. I'm glad you think so. You should have seen it five years ago. Nothing here but the walls, and half of them were falling down. We really worked hard to get where it is today. But enough about me. How are things with the Rangers? Is uh, General Vargas still in charge? I'd love to give him my regards. We owe him and his team a lot. Damn. I'd heard rumors, but... Well, I'm not surprised that's the way he went out. A hero to the end. Thank you for telling me. I'll raise a glass in his honor tonight. Now, what can I do for you? Good luck. Welcome back to Little Vegas, Rangers. Certainly. Ask away. What? I don't want those kind of connections. Murder in the streets is bad for business. If I were you, I'd be looking for someone with a grudge against a patriarch. Not exactly a short list, I know, but... I know Delgado, but I haven't seen him. If he came here, he didn't come to see me. What a shame. Nothing I like more than a good grilling. What else can I do for you? Ah, yes. Had that painted for my office back in Vegas, before the robots came. Not a bad likeness, eh? Thank you, Rangers. That's very flattering, but really. It's not so much that I have an age, but more that the cares and woes of running Vegas back then made me old before my time. Since I've come to Colorado, I feel 20 years younger. Like I said, 15 years after the Rangers saved us, the robots came back. As to why we came to Colorado, well, we heard 
Ah, uh, I know any attempt to recap. And besides, the customers don't know it's a pay. Good luck. Again, red hats. Ah, Mr. Brigo's pride and joy. Our pride and joy. He founded this club at... See this one with the skull? Sheriff Daisy gave it to me for dealing with a corrupt marshal. She was a beast, let me tell you. Razzle dazzle. Was that... That worked, didn't it? She fell... Till next time, red hats. Hey there, what do you need? <laughs> Sorry, chums. Don't know anybody by that name. Can't help. This is the little Vegas. A slice of paradise in a freezing shithole. Loose lips don't get you far in Mr. Brigo's organization. So, all the best vices Colorado has to offer. think you're going? That's off limits without permission from Mr. Brigo. Red hats. You stowed away on an Arapaho convoy? Uh, I love Oh my god. Tell places. me everything. Uh, it, was, uh, it was dirty and cramped and I pitched through a hole in a truck man. Local 168 twats were shitty tippers anyway. Ooh-wee! Always have a time at Little Vegas. Even if I go home. friends. Hello. Oh, hey, 
Kwan. Looking for a good time, I assume. Sorry, Ken. Me and my friends are here on business today. Rangers, meet Kendall, Colorado Springs' finest purveyor of sins of the flesh. That's my name, yes. Excuse me a moment. You really shouldn't ask him about that. He had a misunderstanding with Mr. Brigo, and they cut off his junk. Smooth like a Ken doll. Get it? Makes him a great pimp, though. Delgado, Delgado. You know, that name sounds really familiar, but remembering is going to be hard work. Uh, the kind of work a man should be paid to do. Ken doll, you predictable son of a bitch. I need serious cash. Any less, and it isn't worth the risk. Shit! I knew I should have asked. All right. Don't tell anyone I told you. But Delgado was sniffing around the club, asking too many questions about the Dorseys. Last I saw, Charlie Knowles was pulling him into the back rooms behind the bar. God. Damn it. Now Daisy's gonna want Brigo dead, and she won't take no for an answer. Yeah, okay. Bye. Bet you look even better bent over my knee. Sweetie, everyone has nerves their first time. Let's try again. I... No, I know how to do it. I just... I don't feel like it right now. Hey, hey! Who the hell are... Yeah, well, I was just leaving. Thanks, Ace. I... I guess. Does that work? I, I have been tired lately, focused on, uh, work. Thanks! Look at you, big boy. Okay, sweetie, let's <gasps> try again. Yeah, yeah, oh, so deep. Oh, I can feel your spleen, yes! Oh. Wow, that was so much better than a warm apple pie. You guys are all right in my book. Uh, anything? Uh, maybe. I'm actually here to fix a bug in the club's ventilation system, but uh, I haven't got here is the password. All you gotta do is set the fan to off and the heat to max, which should be impossible, but right now it isn't. As long as you pay your- Thanks again, Ranger. Come back anytime, Benji. <laughs> School's always in I session. know you like what you're- And for a small fee, I'll show you things you had. That's a shame. I've got a lot I could teach you. Right here, gorgeous. Right here. I hope you can stay. Oh, Quan, it's you. Um, uh, uh, hi, Ten. Good, good to see you. I, 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 I'm uh, kind of on duty. Yeah, unless you all want to take take a break for a while. Really? Ten, I... Oh, Quan, it's been so long. I... I wish I'd met you before. All this. Please come back, okay? Please? Gracious. Do people actually want to... Disgusting.
Bet you look even better bent over oh, my here, knee. Oh, honey. You know I'll take care of you. Hail to the king, baby. Time to get sweaty. You ready? Let's do this. Bicep. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Come on, get it. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, oh, feel the burn. Shoulder press. One. Present requests, party humans. Enjoy party time. You having a good time, honey? Woo! Having a good time, honey? This place rocks, right? Hey, you're cramping my moves. This place rocks, right? Woo! Having a good time, honey? is thinking running a straight joint. He's leaving money on the table. Marshals would shut us down if we fixed the games. I guess so. Hope you got good balance, since you be riding bareback all night. You are definitely on my most wanted list. Do you have 11 protons? Because you're so damn fine. Welcome back to Little Vegas, Rangers. Certainly. Ask away. Good information, you say. But I'm sorry. I can't let you go back there. My property, my rules. And if you try it without my permission, my capos will defend my property by all... Good information, but I'm sorry. I can't let you... Good luck. Hello again, Red Hats. <laughs> you like it? Had him in there for weeks, poor bastard. You could hear his screams clear across town. He came back with a fake... What? Yeah, he didn't like it much either. Especially the ending. Well, ain't you a clever seed of Red Hats. Look. It wasn't Mr. Brigo who conspired with the Dorseys. He's not that stupid. But a little bird told me it was someone in our organization. I can give you a name. All you gotta do 
is proof this guy was acting on his own. Way I see it, everybody wins. You get your culprit, and we don't get in trouble with the law. Look for our man McTavish at the machine shop near Pillory Square. I don't care what you do to him, but if you can come back and prove the rest of us weren't involved, I'm sure we can make a deal, yeah? Also, sure. Find a way to prove Mr. Brigo wasn't mixed up in this Dorsey business. Till next time, Red Hats. Oh man, I love dancing in this place. It's the best. But I've heard a rumor that there's an exclusive secret dance party up at Aspen every year. I'm for sure gonna get this right this year. I've never been to Aspen. Oh, look, this time the marshal sent substitutes to shake us down. Well, you stand-ins get one warning. Fuck off or get fucked up. Yeah? Well, McTavish doesn't want to talk to you. And you just used up your one warning. Fuck them up, boys. Who let you in? The odds of my survival are narrowing by the second.
This time the marshal sense. Yeah, right. We warned you. Fuck him up. This is not the best way to begin an engagement. <laughs>
shot, my boys. Well, I'm not looking for a bullet in the face, so you can fuck right the hell off. Can you? You then we numpty Sunlanders who well, came all the way from Arizona to suck the Patriarch's cock. But what happened to the rest of yous? Couldn't you tuck the cold? Couldn't you drive on ice? <laughs> Couldn't you <they> swim? <laughs> Information is that laddie da? Or maybe it's just some shit you heard. Like my babag, you flatland hacks. I'm under Farm Brago's protection, so you can't touch me, pal. Huh? No, I, I mean. If you shoot me, then he's... Ah, what a load of shite. It's OK, OK. Looks like you got me at a disadvantage, so let's make a deal, eh? You push flaps drop me enough to skip tune, and I'll tell you what I can. Ah, damn it the hell. I'm not going back to the stocks, no way. If I... OK, yeah. I let the doses in the city. And I'm glad I did. Least I could do after the patriarch put me in the pillories. Asshole throws my bloody face off. I got a career where my nose should be. Of course I wanted some revenge. Wouldn't you? But No, no way. Why would they think that? Mr Bragg would not have to do with us nothing. What are you going to do with me? Custody, you hoors! Didn't I tell you what you want to know, you fucking love it, the same! Copy, November 1. This is Ranger HQ. Go ahead. Copy that, Team November. I'll let the Sheriff know she needs to make an arrest.
rather freeze to death or burn. You're a barrel of monkeys, huh? Now come on, answer the question. All right, all right. Burn. Nice to see <laughs> the city faster. back to life. Free formation, so your yeah. family stays a few bucks on the Nice job getting McTavish off the streets, Rangers. Got any other good news for me? Let me see that. Hmm, Brago wrote this? That means he knew what McTavish was planning, and he didn't tell a soul. Rangers, you've got my full support. Oh, and thanks for sending McTavish our way. Glad I can rely on you folks to be neighborly. Roger that. Taiwan Jones's Emporium, my Sergeant Lee. It was an old security drone. Its timing belt broke, so it uh vibrates real fast. Wow. What's the rush, huh? Why don't you tell your old pal Charlie what you found out from McTavish? Well done, Red Hats. Thing is, maybe I made it sound like I could get you into the back, but I can't without Mr. Brigo say so. Go talk to him. Tell him what you found out, and I'm sure he'll be open to a deal. Ah. Uh, so, uh, what'd you do to that poor bastard McTavish? Ooh, that's a fate worse than death for McTavish. Rough break. All right, you should go on upstairs and talk to Mr. Bright. See you later, Red Hats. Oh, oh, oh. 
I can find I you love, uh, You don't I know what you're talking about. about this place. Hey, you're hey, you're cramping my moves. I get the feeling this isn't a social call. I understand you had a little talk with McTavish. And I want you to know I'm as appalled as you are that he let the Dorseys into the city. He served me well. But, well, he's always been an idiot. Now, what do you want to talk to me about? In my profession, you can't be too trusting with new friends. I uh, had you follow. It won't happen. Is that a threat? Oh, I'm not admitting I know anything about Delgado, but what did you have in mind? Hmm, I like that. Keeps Daisy out of my business and takes care of a problem I didn't want in the first place. All right, you got a deal. And I tell you what, because you've been so reasonable, I'll do you one more favor. What do you say? Fantastic. And you'll have a fully staffed armory by the time you get back to your headquarters. Pleasure doing business with you, Rangers. Feels like old times. What a surprise to see you here, Rangers. What a surprise. It's especially surprising because I figure you'd be coming out of Brigo's suite with him in chains or a bullet hole in his head. But no, what's a damsel like me to think? We've looked the other way long enough. First, Brigo helps out the Dorseys. Then, he locks up a marshal. Your law keepers, right? Like us? It's time to uphold the law. If you're not willing to do that much... Marshal Lupinski, I stand by these people. So if you plan to shoot them, you'll have to shoot me, too. I think you know how that'll go over with the families. Doesn't need to come to that, Miss Wesson. If your friends here make the right choice. So, how about it, Rangers? You wouldn't want to get the little lady hurt, would you? Maybe. Or maybe Brigo sweet-talked his way out of trouble. It doesn't have to go down like this, fellas. Shut the fuck up, Quan. It's going down like this, whether or not you like it. One way or another, there's gonna be blood. So whose side are you on? You really want to piss off the sheriff? For the sake of that rat? Good. Now why don't you mosey back upstairs and arrest Brigo for real then? Oh, get
Now, what do you want to talk to me about? In my profession, you can. I'm not admitting I know anything about Delgado. I don't respond well to threats, Rangers. If you want to die, my capos and I will. Then you're useless to me. Come on, Capo. Show them how we do it in Vegas. Cooperation is key to victory! Consolidate our efforts!
like you're running this show, huh? This might stay a bit. Up and at him, ladies!
right, Rangers. I surrender. Now what? Right. I'm ready. Give me the break. Copy, Team November. This is Ranger HQ. What's new? Over. They've been waiting to bring him in for a long, long time now. We'll deliver the good news. Over and out. Refreshed! 